I want to comment on a little bit, uh, uh, basically, on this interview that this Zumalian warlock uh, gave to actually uh, to this other Zumalian. I talked about this actually uh, warlock or sorcerer many times, and um, I'm not gonna actually come back to his actually bio, but I'm gonna just to be brief. He's actually called the Sheikh Roshay, or he, uh, it means the spraying sheikh or the uh, sprayer uh, sheikh. Uh, Roshay means to spray. And so he's the actually the first uh, actually uh, 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 sorcerer who started actually uh, or exorcist as he, uh, they 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 called uh, themselves to actually uh, start uh, who actually started spraying people with water. And what he does is actually he reads the actually uh, their book the the Muslim book or the Quran uh, basically uh, in the water or maybe something else. And then the, he sprays the, actually the water on people on the actually the the infected people. And he says it actually it heals them. So he's got many actually uh, what places with that, you know, these, um, he, he calls them ilaj. These are the places where they actually exercise the Middle Eastern parasites that are infecting the Zumanians. And so he's giving an interview to this other Zumanian actually about actually uh, what he's actually doing and what he does and actually uh, the spread of these Middle Eastern parasites among the Zumanians. I don't know if this is actually his, his first interview, but this guy actually does a lot of interview actually on uh, on social media, and he goes to the Zumalian platform where he talks about actually the infestation that's actually happening among the Zumalis. Now, uh, in the previous video that I uploaded, uh, the little ex excerpt of actually their interview, he actually mentioned something that is very important uh, for people to understand, and I've been talking about this like in uh, many times. He explains how these Sharia cult, these Middle Eastern parasite, these serpent seed motherfuckers, these hybrids of these Shadims, these hybrids of these Middle Eastern gene parasites actually uh, started spreading their actually parasites. I kid you not. In there, he mentions uh, that uh, he says uh, when the actually the companion of the prophet, he talks about their Middle Eastern actually this narrative. I don't know if this actually is actually uh, is is one of their narrative that they have in their hadith uh, because I don't know because um, uh, it could be that he actually he invented this actually uh, bullshit because they have many of the hadith. They have many of uh, what they call the actually they, they have this hey hadith what they they say these, these hadith certified actually uh, true even though it's they lie. I I can't, you know they, for people actually to understand the Sharia cult, I would ask them to. Actually Actually, advise him to go listen to Christian Prince. I've uh, there is a playlist that I added of Christian Prince, and there is a video where he says, "Do not learn Islam from the Muslim because the Sharia cult are basically liars, notorious demon liars." I kid you not. And so, um, in this, in their hadith, they have what they call they, they call the hadith uh, the if the weak. Uh, some of them actually uh, they don't know. So, in any case, they have these hadith, and he says in one of these hadith. The companion of the prophet, he says, this is what he talks about in the previous video, the little excerpt that I'm translating. He said, these uh, companion of the prophet actually uh, went to actually, uh, I don't know where they were going, but he says they were actually in somewhere. They go settle among these, so they go and then they actually meet these actually uh, nomadic people. But they're not nomadic in, in, in Arabia, they, they will probably be Bedouins. And so they asked it, these people, he says... To actually, you know, uh, 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 they ask hospitality to these people. Remember, we're talking about the Arabia, where motherfuckers are basically settled based on tribes, where these motherfuckers would actually invade motherfuckers. They were basically bandits. They were caravan raiders. Remember, Arabia, where I say cut throat killer motherfuckers in the deserts and shit. All these motherfuckers were thieves, crooks, and uh, thugs. He said this motherfucker didn't know this other motherfucker. So he, they go and then they ask them for hospitality. I kid you not. Remember, these are the companion of the prophet. He says, uh, I'm guessing they were hungry or some shit. But, you know, these are the Allah food soldiers. They didn't ask Allah for food. I don't know, like the Jews, Allah, you know, Allah. Because this, this Sharia cult believes that, you know, the Jews are, were, are Muslims. Everybody is Muslim to them. And they believe the same uh, that, you know, Allah basically is runs actually this game. And so... Apparently, the Jews were getting fed by their actually Allah God, but not these fuckers. So these motherfuckers then go ask a group of basically Arabian who actually were living next. Uh, they go settle. They go to this group of people, to these Bedouins. They ask them for actually hospitality or food, and the group tells back, "We don't know you, and get go get away from us." And this is very important. This is what he says. He says a snake basically beats their chieftain. I kid you not. 
a snake then these motherfuckers settle next to this group of people then a snake beats their chieftain the, the people they settled with and then the people basically go crazy they go like you know they, they, they go crazy and so they say why don't we go ask these group of people who actually just settled next to us just came yesterday or something if they can actually you know spit on his actually wounds they do, do their actually black magic that's what they actually were doing in the middle east and so he says they go to this group of people and then they ask one of them and then one of them says yes i heal you know snake bites just like you know moses type of shit where they were actually healing motherfuckers with snake bites and shit and he says then he asked this group of people 30 in, as a payment 30 uh, basically sheep or goats whatever the fuck they had and remember this is exactly how the sharia cult actually was doing when they came over from the middle east i kid you not the people they settled with they infected them and they actually told the people the this this stories i don't know if this comes from moses but in the stories that they have in the Bu'rba'ir, in the, the zumadian story that i talk about many of these motherfuckers were actually sorcerers or serpent seed motherfuckers they were carrying like prometheus uh, some some of the nastiest parasites from the middle east and the way they would spread these uh, basically uh, the islam was they would infect the locals and then they will tell them we will heal you if you become muslim in here he says they accepted actually uh you know goats but some of them they they will actually accept ask them for goats just goats not sheep in, in the zumadi actually cases i kid you know they only accepted goats and so and then and that became the basic what they call the taxes the zakat i kid you know that's what they you know they, they will tell them it's a it's, it's a zakat it's the taxes that you have to pay for our protection against these middle eastern parasites and for you actually to become muslim or some shit and so this is very important this is a, i'm not making this shit up it's to him this warlock this muslim warlock dressed in the saudi garment this sharia called sharia called mind virus carrier parasites, and these serpent seed motherfuckers the children of the shadims this is what it's come it's their own fucking words i'm not making this shit up and so then the guy asks him like yeah what, what's going on here in zumadia how are they spreading this shit? and then he says the Zumadi in case he says is basically uh, uh, Hasid. I kid you not. Every one of these fuckers tell you that the Zumadians are infected because of jealousy. Go figure. I kid you not. Every one of these Middle Eastern hybrid motherfuckers would tell you that the, the infestation of the Zumadi is because of the Hasid. He says the Zumadian woman doesn't like to be actually... Uh, I, I kid you not. That's what he's saying. He says he, she doesn't like uh, to be married with other women. So basically in the sharia cult they allow you to actually marry for actually wives and so he says because they refuse this actually arrangement this actually that's why she, they, they go actually go crazy then if they infect everybody i kid you know that's what he says and he says right now he's in actually in kenya uh, he's got actually 400 actually zumanian women in a place where he's actually removing these middle eastern parasites and uh, in the morning that's what he does and in the afternoon he actually welcomes a hundred actually zumanian men who are infected and he actually basically also removes the middle eastern parasites from them and yet none of these motherfuckers are actually healed i kid you not and they keep coming to these fuckers i kid you not and in the video like i, I posted he says like you know you're not supposed to ask people for prices if you're actually removing these middle eastern parasites but this fucking sharia called these lying son of mudha these lying son of snakes motherfuckers do nothing but ask prices i kid you not you can't forget about these motherfuckers if you're a christian and you live among them among these fuckers you have to pay the jizya just by just living among these fuckers you have to pay actually the jizya so you really think that they're not going to make someone who's infected by, with the middle eastern parasite the remove they're not going to uh, make that person pay yes they will make that person pay and that's in, in fact that's how they actually make a lot of money i, I kid you know i talked about these fuckers he says uh, at some point there is many actually uh, spraying shakes in Zoom, um, uh, in zumadi i kid you know he said that many of these fuckers are now everywhere and then they're competing with me that's what he says i kid you know this fucker made so much money that now he lives in turkey i kid you know he says like he lives in turkey where he actually actually uh he, he kids his he kids his kids go to, the, to university in turkey i kid you not and it's not only him many of these actually middle eastern sheikhs were coming to zumadi to make money off the zumadians because they are the most infected motherfuckers on this planet i talked about that i kid you not i talked about this like all you have to do is like just go youtube this shit it's everywhere 
the most infected motherfuckers on this planet are, are the Zumanis. And every basically Middle Eastern actually mind various carrier. Any Middle Eastern serpent seed motherfuckers, every motherfucking son of Moda, every fucking son of, of these fucking Middle Eastern Paris, these serpent seed motherfuckers, sheikhs, no dish. They come to actually Zumaria, to, they set up these places and they basically make money off of these motherfuckers. They, they even rape them, that's what he says. I kid you not, that's what he says. He says they even rape these women and then basically create basically babies. They re reproduce, replicate themselves. I kid you not. And many of these motherfuckers are, like I said, many of these motherfuckers are surplus seed motherfuckers. They are the children of these Middle Eastern fucking parasites. Nasty motherfuckers. I kid you not. And they replicate themselves. I kid you not. This motherfucker will look like normal human being, but this motherfucker will be a basically, a, a basically a shaitan. At some point, the, the, the interviewer asks us this motherfucker, how do we know basically who is actually a, a basically a gene a hybrid a shaitan and a normal human being and this fucking basically a sorcerer uh, says if, if you miss uh the players actually you're actually one of you you're a hybrid you're you're you a devil i kid you not that's what he says and so uh he asks him okay, what what about the people who kill motherfuckers and basically who actually steal and all this remember they this motherfuckers they don't believe that they're actually Sharia cult, the murderers actually cult are basically devil. I kid you not. They don't believe in that shit. And so this is what these motherfuckers do. Like I like I I've been telling people, many of these motherfuckers, at some point he says, remember, uh, you know, uh uh, the, what's happening he says okay so this these parasites are spreading because people are actually forgetting islam he says and then he, he, he basically peddles the quran he says if you have the quran is the, the witchcraft the book they use if you have the quran you will you're practically infected and he says at some point remember the the zumalian women before used to actually wear their actually hair actually like you know uh, not covered and they were not infected but in here he says now there's so many demons and devils around people or in this world he says and and that this infestation is basically a product of the world coming to an end this is what the sharia called has been saying they've been saying the world is going to come to an end two thousand years ago and so what the actually motherfucker actually is not saying is that the people he's talking about these women who are not getting infected with their hair actually opened were because they did not have the sharia cult i kid you not the moment this fucking serpent seed carrier motherfuckers these children of these shadims settled next to people these people would get infected i kid you not and so this is what they did this is how they spread the moment these motherfuckers settled among these people the farther you are from these people actually because this motherfucker came in from the coast if you were farther uh, inland from this motherfucker you were okay as long as they did not actually reach you but the moment they reached you actually they would actually spread these middle eastern parasites infect you and basically uh turn you into actually one of them i kid you not and so it's a very very good interview i would ask people to go listen to these actually fuckers they spread everywhere i kid you not and at some point he says he says like now he, like, he lives in turkey in turkey and even in turkey now he's got these big places where actually he actually does the same thing for the zoomanians but don't get it twisted it's not only the zoomanians they have all these places in everywhere these motherfuckers actually uh moved in they have these places in europe they have these places in the u.s they had everywhere that these fuckers actually are uh, settled they actually do they do this they basically spread these middle eastern parasites against each other to actually crumble uh, uh that one another's actually businesses i kid you not this is remember this shit is so deep that this motherfuckers like their shit is basically at the level of the skin ranch actually level you know the the skin the, the what is skinwalker ranch in the u.s the, the the most infected place on this planet is the same fucking here that this fucking motherfuckers created this fucking serpent seed hybrid motherfucking actually children of the shadim this demon cult actually these these basically parasitic fucking cult created that same fucking basically uh basically infestation that skinwalker infestation in zumaria i kid you not and every one of these motherfuckers is actually infected and carries this shit and if you close to these fuckers they will infect you right away i kid you not it the infestation is so deep you can't even fucking believe it it's a crazy shit